Ladies and Michael B's, Michael B's and Michael C's, welcome back. What are we taking? Chicken. Is it, there's no chickens in this pack, unfortunately. There's this guy. Seen one. I think Dreadful Apathy is good. I think Metamized Prophecy is good. I really know nothing in this format, so. Well, that's why you look at the cards now, and then you can see what they are. Michael's the only dude I know who looks at something with all the information right in front of him, says, I don't know anything about that, and then just turns away. <laughs> it's like it's like if I was holding this bottle and someone's like, hey, what's in this bottle of Cholula? And I was like, I don't know any of the ingredients in this bottle. And then I just looked away. That's exactly what happens. I was looking at our food options. Oh, were you? Yeah. Oh, what did you find? I'm looking right now. Oh, okay. Apathy, yeah, those that's what I was literally leaning towards as well. I think it's apathy. I think apathy's better. Vinegar, pepper, sugar. There's actually no sugar in Cholula. I was surprised by this. Water, peppers, oh. salt, vinegar, garlic powder, and z there's not a lot of sugar. There's not sugar in a lot of uh hot sauces, which is why I'll, so many of them are zero calories. Once you add sugar, you gotta add calories too. Buffalo Wild Wings is open till midnight. Yeah, I'd rather not go there. There's also Fox Den's Pizza. Mm. Fox Pizza Den. I had Little Caesars for lunch. There's Del Taco. I literally just said that. Are we just going to draft blue-white again? Mm. Is white-black a strategy? Because neg-3, three, neg-3 three is actually pretty good. I thought... Ch no, Cholula's got no calories, my dude. I got this bottle sitting here right on my desk. Uh, there's Hungry Howie's. I literally just said I had Pizza Hut, Little Caesars I'm for just naming all the things. Here's that ranch Rancheritos place. This place is all right. The nachos were good, but like, the chicken was kind of meh. Would you rather just go to Del Taco? Yeah, probably. If I if I had to choose. Oh, these cards are exciting. Devour isn't even. I don't even think even Devour is that good. No love for Buffalo Wild Wingies. No, none. Literal zero just don't like it no it's like i feel like they're 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 wing stop quality but like without i think the wing stop fries are better and it's also cheaper so do you got a wing stop around here no you would know yeah it'd probably show up in the help it's either this guy or this guy interesting impressive blood aspirin whenever you sacrifice a permanent put a 1-1 counter on it I mean, this guy's good if we go the sacrifice route. I guess we could try that. We have not. When this guy dies, target creature and opponent controls gets neg one, neg one. That's the sacrifice thing. When this enters battlefield, exile a card from an opponent's graveyard. And then at the beginning of each combat, if you control a creature power four greater, it gets plus one, plus one until end of turn. I also like this spider. It's just one, one. It seems bad. Not thrilled with it. You might be able to tell how desperate I was for good wings out here when I was super excited that Wingstop came to town. They still have the... I actually don't... Yeah, I kind of like Wingstop. I think Wingstop's good. Especially for the price. I think their fries are actually really good for some reason. I don't know why they're so good. I guess there's also Culver's. What time is Five Guys close? I think nine, but I'll check. I actually don't like Chimera that much at all. I'm just taking the other black flyer. Uh, when this dies, create a 2 1 goaty boy. When you cast your first spell during each opponent's turn, now, uh, what does this guy do? Uh, create a 1 1. When it, when there's a battlefield, you make a 1 1. This creature can't block whenever you cast a spell that targets. This guy's actually fine. A 4 4 and a 1 1 for, for 5 is not bad. 5 guys is 10 o'clock. Typical. Eh, Temple Thief is good. Yeah, alright. Culver's is open to 11. Interesting. And yeah, that's never happening. Uh, creature gets plus X plus O and trample, where X is the number of counters. So plus one, plus two, plus two, and plus three. And then you get to fight a dude. Yeah, we'll give that a go. Chimera's like the green emerald. You know, I'm not sure if that's true. There's this Steinies family sports grill. Cool story, man. My burger was missing from the bag. Oh, God. 
Yeah, I agree with that. I've had problems with delivery before and there was no one to really talk to. Like, you just have to reorder it. Um, giving this guy trample seems pretty decent with the Triumph of an Axe. Steinies is just okay. Nice. Why is that nice? It's nice that we got a native in the chat to tell us that these restaurants are just oh, yeah. okay. Gotcha. Are you going to just take a second one of these? I think I can get that big brood anywhere, but these uncommon sagas, maybe that's where we want to be. I could go get us something. Where would you even go, man? Nowhere. <laughs> Got him. Go to the Thai place. You'd like that, wouldn't you? I think it'd be alright. I think it'd be alright. I think it'd be alright. You like this this noise I'm making, man? Thai house is good. I agree. Yeah, I like this shit. Go to the Thai place and then it's like, oh, here's talk about Thai house. That's the only one. That's there. the only one. Yeah. Take this rare. Alright, I'm definitely not uh, super familiar with the red black deck, so let's see if we can get familiar with it <clears throat> kfc is selling a taco with a shell made out of fried chicken didn't taco bell already do that no man they made a burger with the, they made a sandwich with a, with a chicken shell no i mean taco bell literally had a taco with oh taco chicken. bell yeah no i don't think so man that doesn't sound correct no that's 100 percent correct they definitely had that with a chicken shell yes Hmm. Told you. Hmm. I never tried it, but why are we making? Why are we using chicken to make these things? When you sacrifice permanent, it gets plus two, plus zero oh until end turn. I kind of like that for our sacrifice deck. Oh, I like final death too. I think it's got to be the slaughter priest though. That guy's the glue that holds the strategy together. Um, gain control of a creature, gains haste, and you scry. Create a 1-1. One, one, draw 2. I like Lampad here just because it's a sack outlet. Oh, what does this guy do? At the beginning of your end step, you may pay 3 and sack a non-land permanent. If you do, reveal cards from the top of your library until you reveal a non-land permanent card. Put that card on the battlefield and the rest of the... Wait, what? You sacrifice a creature... Well, a non-land permanent. Well, sure, but it's going to... So 99% of the time, it's going to be creature. Reveal cards from the top of your library so you can reveal an online permanent. Put that card on the battlefield? That seems really good. Yeah, you like sacrifice something that's like useless. You sack a token to make like a... And put anything on the battlefield? Um, seems good. Whenever two more creatures your opponents uh, can't block. So whenever two more creatures your opponents can... So if they can attack with two creatures, this guy just can't block. I think final fighter's fine. At the beginning of your end step, if you control a creature without four or greater, XL the top card, you may play that. Yeah, that's not bad. No, no. Agonizing Remorse is probably fine. Um, Why does it suck at the end step? I mean, you can play them on turn nine, and then uh, draw two cards, lose your life, put the top two cards in your library to your graveyard. Oh, get off my phone. Don't let me down. The enchantment guy, the 1 2, might be okay in this deck. Do you mean the 1 right? 3? Yeah, the 1 3. Unbelievable. Well, that's why I already have one. Got him. Got him. Uh, Can't block. Oh, yeah, I'll just take this 1 drop. This guy's fine. I want some cheap boys. When this enters the battlefield, there's 4 damage to a creature with planeswalker and playing controls. Yeah, that card's great. Full up arrow? Biatches? What are you saying right now? What does that mean? Yeah, 
Who knows? <laughs> oh, dear God. I'm so happy because I'm a gummy bear, gummy bear. <laughs> Oh boy. This is fine. That's just a shock. Oh yeah, another Grim. Oh yeah, this deck's looking sweet. I think that clip is from uh, Robot Chicken, I would imagine. It certainly looked like it. Certainly. Certainly. It certainly looked like it. <laughs> it certainly oh. did. Oh, this. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh yeah, we're doing it. Oh, we're doing it. We're living that sack dream. This guy's still four, 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 four. With reach, reachy bobichi. Oh, he just can't block sometimes. Yeah, so fine. You know, on occasion. This is this is pack two. I'm done. I'm ready to go. land um i'll take this guy because if we can be like give that guy trample michael yes where are we ordering food from who knows man Oh man, I love that Kraken, but I also like an axe. You know what this card does? You go to your devotion to red. That seems pretty good. Yeah, that card is ba 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 bonkers. What up, cow slug? That's a good name. It's beautiful. So beautiful. <laughs> what are you laughing at, man? It's a funny joke. What was the joke? Funny joke. What, what was the joke? Shut up, man. I hate you. Let's <laughs> just answer the fucking question. I just thought what you said was funny. But it wasn't a joke, Michael. Do you think this is a joke? Look, we got another ass per, per pirate. An ass pirate? It's not it's not appropriate. Oh, another slaughter of jeez, look at all these dudes. We are rolling in it. We go to this truck stop. Truck stop? Yeah. LW's truck stop. Which only has stock photos and only four reviews. It's got five stars. Yeah, they're all probably from employees is my guess. I got two tickets to paradise. Do you, though? Pack your bags, Michael. We'll be leaving tonight, boy. Oh, my God. How many of these guys can I get? What's the second part? Uh, Gains first strike until end of turn. Sack a creature or enchantment. Seems pretty good. So, for two mana, he gets plus two, plus oh, and first strike. Also, just a solid two. And we already have two of them. <laughs> boy, we got... Oh, my God. Another an axe? Jeez. So, you don't want to take the seven three? I already have two of those. Yeah, I definitely want to... Are you being serious? I was joking, yeah. Oh, okay. I was like, what? That card seems bad. I think it's fine because, like, we have combat. We have two of these, which gives it trample. So if it's, like, an 8-3 trample on turn 5 or whatever, like, that's fine. Plus, if they can't kill it, then it's a 9-3 trample. Then it's a 10-3 trample. It's either second an axe or second Iroas' blessing. I think the an axe is probably better. Really? This guy's real good. He makes he makes dudes. Okay. I don't know. It could be wrong, but speaking of food, if you guys like great Chinese food, you should invest in a trip down to Mandarin in Bountiful. Shut up and take my money. I don't know where that is? What? <laughs> what does it say? It's a three hundred dollar donation that says whatever you guys choose to eat, you should order in, so you get to keep playing. 
Okay. Well, I guess reasonable donation for I food, three hundred dollars. I guess that's a deal. God, Tana. <laughs> yep, definitely ordering food. I guess. Oh, Tanos, you are absolutely ridiculous. I love you, dude. Thank you so much, man. So, uh, where are we ordering Wow. <sighs> I get all red in the face, man, when these ridiculous donations from him come through. I have a vote to make. I'm all just like, whew. I don't even know what these cards do anymore, man. Pick that one. I think it's this one, because we can steal their guy and then sack it. It's just a, it's just an act of treason. Steely, and you scry one. Oh my God, Tanos, man, thank you so much, dude. Thank you, unbelievably, so much. If that's even a sentence that can be written, thank you, unbelievably, so much. That's not a word, but that's Did not you a cut sentence. That, man? I'm trying to just find some cuts, man. I think that trick's good. Uh, that trick's good. I mean, we like have a bunch of things that make our guys have tramples, so you should probably play one of those. Actually, you're not. It's not a terrible idea. I wouldn't play two, but... Okay, well, now what? Now it's not good enough for you? I don't know if you want to play three group positions. It's just a 1-1 one, one after all. After all. He just, like, when he dies, he gives him the neg one. I think you guys may have a toxic relationship. <laughs> Why? Because he, like, pays us to do things, basically. I have no idea where to, uh... Well, uh... You know things and stuff what does grim physician actually do uh it's just one one when it dies creature gets negative one negative one okay. return i'm gonna cut one of these pipers i think these are the better sack outlets oh this guy does cost one maybe we do cut one of these i don't, I don't think know, so that's pretty good uh look we have an axe and we have the triumph of an axe it's a it's a theme deck i thought we had two of that guy you do. They're right here. Oh. One's a foil, Michael. A foil, Michael. Um, sacrifice another creature or enchantment. I don't think I don't know where that guy came from. This is twenty five. We need two cuts. Hmm. I do think it's one of what these. What does of the Forge do? It's just it's like a shock. It's a two mana shock that you can scry, scry, okay. which is good. Yeah, I guess we cut one two drop. Wait, what is the lamp pad of the devil? In exchange for money, he won't let you leave the house. <laughs> Wait, isn't that guy just better than lamp pad, though? Who? The slaughter guy. Well, yes, but, like, this also just... It's just a sack. Like, if you have, like, five mana and you need to deal five damage, like, it's nice to have these guys. You know what I mean? Like, if the ground's all gummed up, you're just like, all right, sack five guys, you lose five, I gain five. Yeah. It's a nice... And it's cost one mana to activate rather than two. Both of these are two mana to, to activate. But yeah, you cut one. Right, because we got to make cuts. We have 24 cards. So like, I mean, maybe it's this. Yeah, that's not that great. Yeah, I think this is fine. 12-5, huh? Yeah. 10-7, that seems about right. All right, let's do it. Really, Lampad's been the card that we need most. Interesting. I could see cutting one of the Slaughter Priests. Like, they're great, but they're kind of expensive. I don't know. This guy's just going to get huge, I think. Yeah, all right. I think 2-2-2 two, two, and two is fine. I don't feel bad about that. Tanos, you were awesome, dude. I appreciate you so much, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, do you want Thai food? <laughs> you know what? Maybe. The funny thing is on Yelp, Thai House doesn't have that good of reviews, but... It's been delicious every time we've had it. How many times have you had it? Twice. Oh, they close at 8.45, so... Uh, oh, that's probably not... Yeah. yeah, that's like 18 minutes. <laughs> hey, can we put in two orders to go? <laughs> in before Dream Trawler and Heliod. Yikes. Technically, it'd be one order, Frank. Boo, 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 boo. How would it be? Oh, wow. Can we get one order, two meals, please? Thank you. Michael B would get two meals there. He'd be like, Yeah, I would definitely get fried rice and fat tie. Wow. 
Michael likes to spend at least twenty dollars on every meal he has. <laughs> And this is why he's broke. Hashtag, this is why I'm broke. I was going to start a trending hashtag called, this is why I'm broke. And it was going to be just about Michael. Because <laughs> he just spends so much money on food. It's unreal. Was that 1-3? This is mirror match? I can't deny it. I know. You just play the Seder, right? The Seder? Or this, the Piper? The Seder? The Piper? Mm-hmm. What does that do? It's 1-3. I guess maybe it's better to get the aspartame out. Get the aspartame out. What are we sacrificing though? Why don't we just get this guy out? It's two two. Well, not yet, but then you could play the aspirant, and mm-hmm. then next turn you could play the piper. Uh huh. And then the turn after that, I could okay, s- that's a long wait. I'm like, I could still do that, but at least now I'm not taking one damage because I have a one one and a two one. Oh wow, that's aggressive. Get wrecked. Did did I? He did. Wow. All right, so let's look for places open past nine to order from. Yeah, probably past nine. That should be safe. He's been dancing. He's been looking. I can just go get it, too. It's fine. What did they just cast? Oh, they drew two and put the top two cards. Did they put the top two cards of their library into their graveyard? And one went below the funeral rites and one went on top of the funeral rites? Because that's, that's kind of funny. All right, that was a good draw. She's been dancing with. This is a this is a Guns N' Roses song called Mr. Brownstone. Is that what it's called? Mr. Brownstone. I'm pretty sure it's about heroin, but. Now we got Costa Vita. Man, that's like a part of a burrito in the fridge, bro. We got Tandoori Oven. I do like, oh, I do like Tandoori Oven. It's hard to eat on stream, though. I think that's something the that opportunities of wealth changes for any. We'll spend a lot more money on, on a lot less food because caloric input per dollar doesn't have nearly as much weight to us as how much we enjoy. Uh, yeah, I agree with that. The problem is Mike is not wealthy. You know, so he's like, well, uh, I, I'm not going to have money for food tomorrow because I don't get paid until the next day because I spent $40 on a big steak today. And I'm just like, why do you do this? I cannot believe you've done this. too much on that steak. That's for sure. I cannot believe you've done this. All creatures able to block this do so. It was a really good steak, though. I definitely enjoyed it. Oh, well, that's good. M- Morty's Cafe. Oh, that's pretty good. I got Texas Roadhouse, but I feel like you want to go there because of the rolls. You don't really want to order that. Maybe you do. Hey, man. You could just, we could order from El Toro Veo. Also, again, you don't get the salsas, so not as good. And I still have a burrito in the fridge. Angie's, which you don't want, so we'll skip that one. Linone, which we just had. Culver's Lucky Slice. Culver's Lucky Slice? No. Is that a I restaurant? Several places. <laughs> we can just order from Lucky Slice. Yeah, except for the fact that I've literally had pizza oh, for yeah, lunch dang. today, which I've told you twice. Okay, we got wingers. Oh, my God. I'm trying to figure out what to do here. I think we just keep this up and double sack. What the hell is Firehouse Pizzeria? What isn't it? Think about it. They got a fuzuki. A fuzuki? Yeah, they got wings. They got beer. Where's your actual food at, bro? Oh, this is like a wood fire pizza place. So that's not going to do. Mike, do you have a pressure cooker with some rice and stock? You can make a kick-ass risotto. No, he doesn't have anything, dude. He doesn't own any, like, kitchen things whatsoever. It's crazy to me. You don't need a pressure cooker to make risotto, technically. That changes nothing about what I said or that or your motivation to actually make those foods. And you don't, but I think his point was that he was trying to give you a simple way to do it. Oh, sure. I might be making a spaghetti dinner at some point this week. No, you won't. Mike, do you know how to cook? Do you like doing so? I don't mind cooking. I'm not that great at it, but... 
Well, you know how you get better at things. Tell me. You do you more often. Oh shit! Really? Yeah. Oh shit! What up? It's wild, right? Juniper Takeout Restaurant. What the hell is that? Well, I'm gonna sacrifice my guy to gain deal to gain deal to gain. Got sweet potato waffle fries. Don't we all? Got sandwiches. Yeah, this place doesn't look great. <laughs> You're just naming random restaurants. Cafe Sabor. Saboba? Saboba. Hey. What is this? No, it's just a Mexican place. Wow, that's that's rude. Wow, Subway has five stars with one review. It sure does. Hey, Nessie and Boar, you're really scary. Bronzehide Lion and Nessie and Boar, two rares. Apparently, all about oh, three rares. Don't, don't forget about the uh, Femia, the Cacophony. Well, this Chinese place actually looks decent. Mm. But you're not really into Chinese food, so. I love Chinese food. You don't. I love it. You like it from a place that doesn't exist here. Olive Garden. I love Olive Garden. Oh, we could get Five Guys now. I love Five Guys. They're open until 10. They're open until 10. Thank you. That's an option. Spaghetti Toucher, thanks so much for the reset. We really appreciate it, buddy. You'd be surprised how many people think you get better at things just by... No, you actually have to practice doing those things. Uh, Cypress creature, it gets deals one damage target creature. That creature can't block this turn. So we can be like, no blocks, no blocks. That's interesting. Wait, did they use their only white source on this guy? That's weird. I cannot believe you've done this. Dies or turns battlefield is an aura enchantment with enchant creature you control. So it's just they just put it on this guy and make this dude like a 10 6 indestructible, huh? That seems good. Seems very good. And that board just keeps messing you up. Yeah, I'm aware. I'm aware. <sighs> Does one ever start a creature or player? Our creature planeswalker or player controls. But like this guy having indestructible just, just just utterly demolishes us. Assembling my sandwiches. <laughs> oh, I love it. Sandwiches assemble. All creatures able to block this do so. That's just unbelievably good. I don't think we can attack here. I do kind of want to get this out, but I don't think it's. You're about to get wrathed. Wrathed? By the boar. Shut up, buddy. Yeah, I'm just going to pass here and then scry, I guess. Oh, the omen's also good because it can... Because it can... It's a sacrifice effect for all these guys, so... Tap lamp pad. Sure. Who cares about that? Interesting. Um, there's a lot of, a lot of things happening.
Oh, I don't think we have Port Number Trail in the deck, actually. Do we? Do we leave it in? Oh, that's pretty cool. Shining creature gets neg three, neg three, huh? Hmm. So that's unfortunate. So if we sack this to here like we can shoot something for like but we the, the nice thing is we have two of these guys which we can sack two things to them to shoot twice but all their guys have three toughness <laughs> so it's kind of awkward but we do kind of want to tap both of these guys because otherwise just going to be forced to block here right so it's kind of like But now we can block with four, five, six. Oh, these guys can't block, so that's unfortunate. But it has a damage on it, so we can actually we could actually block with the blood aspirant if we wanted to. Sure. Interesting. It gets trample. It's pretty good. <sighs> so that's probably game then, right? 11, 12, 13, 14. You block and sack. 5-5, five, five, take... Six, seven, and then just sacks a guy. Yeah, we're dead. Sure. Yeah, on that, we're definitely dead. Six, seven, eight. Oh my god, steel. Oh, so close. <laughs> I guess it's not that close, but. Um, four, five, six. We can play this, give this guy trample, attack with everything. I don't think anything is going to really uh, change the course of this game, unfortunately. Yeah. <sighs> it's really annoying. So it was the next wow. card. Yeah. It was it was the next card. Just to be clear. You'd definitely be dead if we had that. Why didn't we just kill this guy who makes trample with with what? He has four toughness, homie. I don't know how we kill him. Who has four toughness? It was a three. I mean, it was two three, but like that doesn't change anything. Uh, I mean, I don't think that puts us in any. Yeah, actually, maybe. Because 
because we're five we still take one next turn from the other guy all of our guys have to block that idiot i don't know actually yeah that might have made a difference actually i don't think it would have Yeah, I don't know. I think our deck is... Again, I think our deck is good, but... Sometimes your opponent draws three rares, and you're just like... Okay. Yeah, I mean, maybe that would have made a big... Yeah, maybe that would have been a big game. Seems good. Our opponent, Kelvar, went to summer camp with Mike B in 1965 with chicken nugs were plentiful and Elvis worked as temp for Doc Holland. That's interesting, man. I actually didn't even know that. I didn't even know I was alive back then. Now you know. Must have forgot. Makes sense. Oh, wow. They hit the perfect enchantment two unknown shores in your deck jeez that's a bummer mm. crash on in this will deal a lot here if we wanted to Thank you. The old lamp hat. Pilot Eater, thanks so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Mike Defects. <laughs> oh, look. You're in my favorite. Yep. 11-7, huh? Sure. Well, see you later. Turkish you control fights up to one creature you don't control. trades I doubt it are we just gonna lose to Nessian board every game how has triumph been what is um I mean this is the first time I've cast it so draw two cards that's kind of cool yes unfortunately what did they do they just played the what they just played draw two, and then now they're at four, and I have a four four. Oh, you get to kill my guy. Oh, that's good. It's good for you. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the ticket. That's the ticket. <laughs> Got him. Hmm. Got him. Cards doing work. Got him. Got him. I feel like we did concede prematurely the first. Put on the glasses. Hey, man, where are your glasses anyway? Where are the glasses? They're in my drawer. I haven't taken them out yet. Ugh. Guys, should we get Mike B to do some VR soon? 
That might be hilarious. Oh, it would definitely be hilarious. For me to poop on. Hey, man, where are we ordering from? I thought we were ordering from uh, Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. You never heard of Taco Tuesday? No, I haven't, actually. Well, you're a dummy, Michael, and uh, you should probably get out more, because you clearly are an un un uncultured swine. Is that it, huh? Got him. Okay, red mana, red mana, red mana, red mana, red mana, red mana, red, red, red. I want a mountain, I want a mountain. Everybody give me that snow mountain. Okay, one more time I need a mountain. Everybody mountain, mountain, mountain. This is my mountain song. It's pretty good. Dang it, Pykel. I know, I'm telling you. Mountain. Oh my god, we did it. We did it. Is this what living the dream feels like? I've never felt it before. I That's guess, good to have. I guess we just attack. That is good to have. A sack outlet's nice too, though. I guess if we... Alright. I don't want to play the another in Axe. Because he's legendary? He legendary. It's also... I think we could just make two two twos, right? Because <laughs> this guy goes to a 4-3. <coughs> you sack one, and if the creature has power four, we're going to make two one ones. Do you find your red mana taps for more? I don't, actually. Really I find should. it taps for less because the natural environment needs more red mana. Each other creature you control enters the battlefield. That's insane. That's such a good one. What does it do? Each other creature enters with an additional 1-1 one, one counter on it. That's pretty good. Right. I guess I'll just kill it. For me to poop on. What I would love to have is more mana. This guy seems good with mana. This guy seems good with mana. Like, fuck, every game, dude. It's so ridiculous. I don't he even... literally gets it every game. Oh, yeah, it's three out of three. I don't even know. Like, I mean, I'm, I'm feeling like I shouldn't even played this, but if we draw, pump spell, pump spell. Ugh. Of course, if we hit our fucking land drops, we would actually be able to kill this thing. But that is a lot to ask. These guys can't even block. Got them. Jokes on you, dumb. Oh, another rare. Fuck! <laughs> like a five rare dot deck. I got the perfect enchantment deck. Okay, dude. You got it. Now we can't even steal it effectively. Yep. <sighs> can't play 7-3 yet. Literally can't do anything because he missed four land drops, three land drops. Like, it's... All we can really do is play the... NX guy and jump. It sounds absolutely terrible. No, it's almost lethal if we don't. I guess we could, like, kill something instead. <clears throat> Nothing sounds good here. Well, if we steal this, they have to block with all three of their guys. Oh, that's a good point. But they do get to draw three cards. So that's terrible. Yeah. Like, if we had mana, like, we could act if we had one more land, we can play both of these, kill this guy. Like, the fact that, like, they just don't... I, like, missing so many land drops in a row has just been absolutely miserable. I mean, I feel like we just have to play this guy and just hope we hit, like... No, there's nothing we can hit. Yeah. Cool. This is 15 damage.
You know, it's going to be comical. We're going to be able to play this, steal this guy for 10, and have three on board. And they're going to go to one. Oh, they're not. No, they're not being greedy. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five. So we're not dead. Depends on what he has. Does guy have trample? No. Jeez, I'm just like... It's so disheartening. You can play the 7 3 and hope it gets to block the 10, whatever. Get the draw card. Yeah, I mean, what are you going to do? Hope they don't have another uh, Myers Grass. Myers Grass number 3, I guess. <laughs> yeah, their deck's ridiculous. Cool. Oh, yeah, we're dead. Must be nice to always have it every single turn. I wouldn't know personally, but it sounds like it's a cool thing to do. Oh, good times. Good times. Save the steel play for when they play three more rares this turn. Yeah. This is just an uncommon, though. So, so the deck was like rare, rare, uncommon, really good uncommon, really good common, really good common. Like, okay. Also, the other two rares that we didn't see this game, so. I don't know. Their deck seems fucking ridiculous, so. Anyway. We're eating, man. Getting tired of your shenanigans. You didn't suggest a single thing yet. I suggested all the things. Oh. Literally all the things. Literally everything. Tandori Evan sounds fucking great. It always sounds great. I'm gonna keep this slow hand because I don't think this format in general is that fast, but we'll see. This deck looks like the decks that show up with the second pre release. People crack their boxes and went to the first pre release and totally aren't sliding cards into their pool. Yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. Just go get that Tandori Evan, man. You know you want it. He died. Michael B. died, ladies and gentlemen. Man. I'd love to draw something to play. We only have like 14 two drops in our deck. What are you looking at? Wait, did you not like my suggestion? Uh, it's okay. What do, what do you want? I don't even know, man. Okay, well, let's just wait until 10, and then we'll, uh, and then we'll just not eat. <laughs> oh, good, they drew a guy that kills my guy. I guess I could have infuriated, but I don't know if I'm that committed to this slaughter priest. Yeah, I keep a lot of hands because they have lands in them. Like, I'm actually so spoiled. Like, magic has so uh, abused me. Um, that I, my, whether I keep a hand or not depends on whether I have like three or more lands. Like I've definitely kept hands that had like five lands in them solely because I was afraid of not drawing any lands. The only thing I don't like of ordering from, uh, Indian places is sometimes they'll only give you one rice. So ask for another rice. So you literally use your words and mm -hmm. you say, can we get two rices? And then they give you two rices. All right. Oh, you didn't think about that, did you? I've never considered it asking before. Oh, good. Final flare. Nice. Well, it's okay. We'll be done with this draft before you know it because this format is actual. I have not enjoyed this format. I don't know if it's me. They do close in 30 minutes, but I guess that's okay for if I'm going to pick You're it up. You're just picking right? it up, man. Yeah. 
They're just scooping some goo into a pot. <laughs> Whenever it dies, it deals two damage to a creature or planeswalker and opponent controls. Sure. game has been magical all right what do you want you know what i want you got the same thing every time man the paneer tikka masala yeah boy mild no when medium? do i ever mild medium yeah. Medium? Yeah. And a garlic knot. Yeah, boy. That's right. You want to split a vegetable of Cora? No. Okay. I ain't about no $6 appetizer. You only get two. Like, then it's like one pakora for like two fifty. Oh, no. I was talking about... Oh, pakora? No. Pecora, yeah. That's like the fried... Still doesn't do it for me. No. Okay. I'm going to call him up. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Fuck this. <laughs> I'm just done, dude. I'm going to mute the mics for a second so that you guys can't hear Mike's order. Okay. All right, 15 minutes, so I'll leave in 10. Yeah, because if you say an extra rice, they're just going to charge you for an extra order of rice. So just like be like, they're two separate orders for two separate people, so can we get two rices? You know what? I'll take two here. Must feel good to have it all the time, every time. These opponents... Yeah, I don't know, man. Like, I can't tell if it's the format if I'm just playing it terribly. I can't tell if it's just, like, terrible luck. I can't tell if, like, my decks are just bad. I really actually can't tell what the, the culprit is in terms of these games.
but like it definitely feels imbalanced. Make sure Mike's figures out your address on street. That's also I wasn't sure he was gonna have to. I forgot that it was like uh oh, I'm picking it up. Yeah. But I also wasn't sure if he was like paying over the phone either. Here you can just have him split it, because they're good at that anyway. Oh, I thought it was on Tanos. Oh. Yeah, that's fine then. I don't know why I said it like that. Tanos. Oh, I don't know who Tanos is. Yeah, that's a <laughs> that's a different person, I think. I will put a plus one, plus two on my guy. I got five cards. They haven't played anything. Oh, look, they did. They put a plus one, plus two on their guy. That's wild. I guess we'll just kill it. I'm just... All right, well, we have two removal spells. They have five cards in hand, so I'm sure this will go well. Okay, well. What you picking up? A removal spell. Joke's on you. I don't even have any creatures. <sighs> That's hilarious. They give me the one creature that, like, I want to die, and then they're like, the removal is not... We're still going to play it, because... I'm not going to just hoard creatures because they have one removal spell. Yep. Ah, second light. Seems good. In response, I'll exile it. Yep, because you got that second white just in time. Exact turn you needed it. It's all coming together, guys. Thanos. <laughs> oh boy. Good times. Good times. All right. Well, we got two creatures now. We also have enough to portent and sacrifice, so that's good. Oh. Oh, nice. Yep. Seven lands. Yeah, I have no idea. Like, I'd love to... I mean, I don't know. Maybe I need to watch more Theros draft videos because, like, I felt like our last deck was very, very good and then we lost two... Well, I guess... I mean, it's, it's hard to not feel like you're doing poorly even though, like, round one we legit lost to Mana Screw and round three we legit lost to, like, Humongous Rares, Dream Trawler, Heliod, whatever. I mean, and theoretically, like, I could have just saved my removal until they had Heliod, but, like... I'm, I don't love playing in such a way where it's like, well, I'll just hold my thing and hope they don't ever draw it. Or, you know, in case they do. And then if they never draw it that game, you just wasted your removal, you know? So. They're at 12. They have four cards in hand. Like, What are the odds this resolves? Zero. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's just like, oh, come on, man. Like, it's so stupid, dude. Sure. Like, this is a legit never-didn't-have-it situation. Like, I don't even... It feels not... It all. feels fake. Like, I'm not even going to give them a chance to untap because I just want to try to kill this guy now. <laughs> I, 
I don't, I don't know, man. Like, I don't know. I guess. It's like, is it real? I can't tell if yeah, this is real. Yeah, insane. Like, oh. Okay, so I had this guy. They didn't, like, I mean, they just blocked it and then pumped their guy, so it didn't really make a difference. Um, this card was the, the card that didn't make a difference combined with this. That didn't matter. Uh, Myers Grasp was... I guess we did get to kill a guy with that. Uh, they killed this guy. They killed this guy. They countered this. They exiled this. So, yeah, I don't know. It just, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm, I mean, I, I'm obviously biased because it's happening to me, but like, uh, <laughs> sure. I mean, we should have, we should have opened there, but I was like, obviously a little distracted. I don't know what their four cards are. Like, it's kind of... It's almost a little confusing that you have four cards, but only a 2-2 two -two on board. <laughs> yeah, I'll take a 2-1. Whatever. Yeah, the thing is, I I I have no uh, I I have no concern that they're ghosting whatsoever. That doesn't even. No, they'd still be drawing incredibly well. Right, like anything. it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't change anything, unfortunately. Uh, Sorry, I, I just think I'm too stupid to understand this. Me too. I'm just gonna lose to a two-two. <sighs> well, I, I don't know. If I were to look at my deck, I think it was a perfect example of the sacrifice deck in this format. But apparently. <laughs> Rare and have... how do you have two of these in your hand? Why didn't you play either of these? What? Why would you be holding one of these at any point? Also, our guy won't be able to block. Just so we're clear, you had a two one and a three four in hand. You played neither. Then you played them both on one turn. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. I don't get it. Like, why would you... Did you draw a card? No, you didn't draw anything. What the... Yeah, I don't get it. But, unfortunately... Like, this deck looks good to me. I guess I'm just wrong. I don't know. Like, I don't know. Where's the drop button? Nope, that leads me to an outside link, I guess. Um, drop from... Well, it's like hidden down there. Yep, drop. Unfortunately. Wow, that was brutal. I did not expect to go O2. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Let me know what you think in the comments. I would love to hear your thoughts because like these decks have seemed fine. And I don't know... Maybe it's... I mean, I know I'm not playing perfectly. Obviously, I'm streaming. I'm distracted. You know, I'm talking to you guys. I'm reading the chat. I'm misclicking, but that's fine. But, like, I don't think these misclicks, are, like, should amount to an entire draft's worth of losses. So, like, you know, I, I don't know. Maybe, like, have my opponents been extremely lucky? Or have their decks just been overpowered? Let me know what you guys think. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at manatraders.com. Patreon.com slash Frank Lepore. Cool stuff, Inc. every Wednesday. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.